Our earliest prototype. She isn't fancy, but she works. Usually. Now, we kept her operational in case the crew of the mothership ever needed a rescue. We call this one the lifeboat. Their CPUs are linked. And unfortunately, she can't tell us exactly where the mothership has gone, but she can tell us when. Naturally. Only tells you when. Time machine problems. Yes, we're working on it, but for the moment, that's the best we have. 3.30 p.m. May 6, 1937. We found this on the dead shooter. It's an address, a tavern in Manchester, New Jersey. That's the Hindenburg, about four hours before it crashed. You're telling me that this guy actually went back in time, for real, to the Hindenburg. Lucy, if Flynn kills people in 37 who aren't supposed to die, they don't have the kids they're supposed to have, do the things they're supposed to do. History changes. Reality changes. So why would you be stupid enough to invent something so dangerous? I didn't count on this happening. Why would Flynn do it? We don't know. But there's a room in there for three passengers. Wait, to, to do what? Go after him? Why else would we bring you here? You're insane. I mean, even if I believed you, which I don't, I'm not getting in that thing to, what, go after some terrorist? I am not a soldier. If we have a soldier, we need a historian. A good one who knows the customs, can travel incognito, help us keep a low profile. Great, I'll email you some names. I think someone who loved history would want to save it. Besides, what if I am telling the truth? Don't tell me you're not the least bit curious. <laughs>